hey guys welcome back so in our previous video we have done our groundwork so if you go near a wall that is high enough it will it would uh, print climb and if it's lower it will print vote so today let's set up our animations so if you're new, new to this channel and this is the first uh, this is the first time you can actually get these four animations there will be a link in the description and first let's select all of them and right click create an montage and now go inside the third person anim bp wait for it to open so in here you want to go to the anim graph and before the final animation pose add a slot and make sure that you add this one because if you don't the animations won't the anim montage won't work so let's first do and also okay, okay. Let's also make sure that this one in your animation files the root motion is enabled. If you don't have this enabled, you might get some weird results. So first let's do our vaulting. So first thing we wanna do is take our capsule component and set its collision to no collision and also take the character movement and set movement mode to flying and also we want to face the direction of the wall even if we are tracing the wall in a different direction so we want also we want to also set actor rotation and the actor rotation on the set it to is to be our wall normal and make rotation from X then break this one break rotator get actor rotation break uh, split break this one as well and let's make it here make rotator we want our X and Y to be the same and our Y the Z we want to first add 180 and then add to here so now if I go in now if we might get some weird result right now so if I was like tracing the wall facing this way It's not working because it's not, not the climbing as you can see the uh, character actually faced the wall and now it's going weird because if we go ahead and trace our wall the character actually faces the wall So next we want to do is check to see if the wall is thick or not because if the wall is thick we want to get up on that one and if it's like thinner we want to like 
go ahead and vote over it so first let's play Liana montage and the first thing I want to do is check if the wall is thick or not so we'll do the voting first and set this one here let's also add a delay and after we are done doing our animation we want to reset the capsule collision and the character movement to default so set this one collision enable and the next one is going to be walking so now let's see if our system works so as you can see we are now voting over the wall of course it's not looking as pleasant so next we're gonna do is before we are we play our animal touch here we want to do some offsets because the animations are not actually set up well so the first thing i want to do is set actor location and if i now go in and check how the animation works you can see he's actually going a bit more a bit forward than the wall so we want to go set his location further than the wall just so the animation looks right so to do that we will first let's make some room here so to do that first we're gonna take our wall normal actually we can copy some code from here so just copy this part and paste it here so the amount let's first do 30 units and instead of the wall location okay first let's try this one So now if I Yeah, it's probably something wrong here. So we will also need to do is set the Z axis. I think that's where the problem is. To something Let's break this one out and let's just say set X and Y and the Z it's gonna be let's take our wall height here and let's minus this one and let's go 20 and let's also break this one and this is gonna be our Z so let's see if it works uh, I guess it didn't work see why so we're setting is X and Y Let's increase this one Let's increase it a bit more let's go 100 okay, that's I 
think that's too much let's go 70 okay I did this like five months ago and I don't think I remember how I get it to work so I might have to do some experimenting so you can see the distance is working but the height is kind of off so let's make that as well let's go down 10 units okay this looks right okay so this is actually looking on bear so let's also set up a way to get up on walls that are thick so let's make this one a bit thicker Okay, so if the wall is thick, let's do the animation here. Let's duplicate this one and we're gonna get up on our wall. So let's see how it works without any adjustments. So now if I go near a thick wall, you can see it gets up, but of course there is a lot more weirdness going on. So let's copy this part and take this here. Let's see how it looks now. Yeah, it looks sort of okay, I guess. But let's put this one to zero. Let's see how it looks. Yeah, it's looking fine right now. Now to get rid of the extra, like he kind of walks after going up on the wall and he does the same thing after like the voting is finished. That's actually because even though the animation gets finished, there is like a small amount of duration that it needs to reset so to fix that we can go inside our animations and check the time here so you can see at 0.8 seconds he is on the wall so let's put that number here and let's also check the voting time so as he finishes here you can see at 0.9 seconds he has done the voting so Maybe set it to one second here. Let's check how it looks. So now if I go up, there's not 
not much weirdness going on. And to fix this, like the jitteriness, you can also go inside uh, the Anna montage file and select the blend out time to like 0.5 or something. So let's see if uh, yeah, you can see it looks a lot better right now. Let's also set that for our voting. 0.5. Yeah. So this is the end of this video.